The scorching hot world of 55 Cancri, located roughly 41 light years away, has captured the imagination of astronomers for years. 55 Cancri A was found in 2004 by the wobble it caused in its host star's motion, as seen from our perspective on Earth. This is called the Radial Velocity Exoplanet Discovery Method for Exoplanet Discovery. Originally named Janssen, the world was the first super-Earth identified orbiting a distant main sequence star, or a star that is still converting hydrogen to helium at its core. This super-Earth, nearly twice the width and nine times the mass of our own planet, and completing one circuit in less than 18 hours is unlike anything in our solar system. Theories suggest it's composed largely of compressed carbon, essentially a giant diamond. But the true intrigue lies in its atmosphere, a story of loss, and surprising rebirth revealed by the James Webb Space Telescope. Early observations painted a harsh picture of 55 Cancri E, its proximity to its sun-like star, a mere 1.4 million miles away, compared to Earth's 93 million miles, exposes it to intense radiation. with temperatures likely exceeding 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit, hot enough to melt most metals, and an intense bombardment of radiation from its host star. This relentless heat is believed to have ripped away any original atmosphere, leaving behind a barren, rocky surface. This scenario is common for rocky planets locked in such a tight dance with their stars. However, the story took an unexpected turn with the arrival of JBST. This powerful space telescope, with its ability to detect faint infrared light, peered through the furnace surrounding 55 Cancri E and revealed a surprising truth. A team led by researchers at NASA's Jet Propulsion Lab in Pasadena, California, discovered the likely presence of carbon dioxide and carbon monoxide gas around the planet marking the first time JWST has found strong signs of an atmosphere around a rocky planet. The team also found no evidence for helium and hydrogen, the most common elements in the universe, which would have been part of the planet's initial atmosphere when it formed. This means that the atmosphere detected is likely the planet's secondary atmosphere. The presence of this secondary atmosphere throws a curveball at our understanding of super-Earths. How did a world stripped bare by its star manage to regrow an atmosphere? Astronomers believe they have the answer, volcanic outgassing. Intense heat from the star likely melts the rocky interior of 55 Cancri E, causing volcanic activity. These eruptions release gases that replenish the atmosphere, creating a new layer on top of the lost one. JWST's observations provide the first ever measurements of such a secondary atmosphere on a rocky exoplanet, offering a glimpse into a previously unseen process. The discovery of a secondary atmosphere on 55 Cancri raises a multitude of questions. What exactly is the composition of this new atmosphere? How does it interact 
with the harsh radiation from the star. JWST's data holds the key to unlocking these secrets. By analyzing the spectrum of light emitted by the atmosphere, scientists can identify the gases it contains. This information will provide a deeper understanding of the volcanic processes within 55 Cancri A and the resilience of atmospheres on super-Earths. The case of 55 Cancri E demonstrates the invaluable contribution of JWST to exoplanet research. Its ability to peer through harsh environments and detect faint signals allows astronomers to study atmospheres in unprecedented detail. This paves the way for the exploration of a wider range of exoplanets, from scorching hot worlds like 55 Cancri E to potentially habitable planets orbiting distant stars. With JWST's continued observations, we can unlock the secrets of these alien worlds, rewrite our understanding of planetary formation, and perhaps even discover the building blocks of life beyond our solar system. As we conclude this virtual odyssey, we invite you to like and subscribe to our channel to embark on further cosmic explorations. With every click, you elevate our pursuit of knowledge and contribute to the collective understanding of our universe.